As a kid, I saw how fish were swimming, and the patterns of the way their fins moved were mimicking the shape that seaweeds were changing into when waves went past. And so seeing that as a kid, I became fascinated, and I've spent my life introducing these swirling paths into all sorts of industrial applications. Our heart muscles are in the shape of whirlpools, and when we breathe in and out, it's in the shape of whirlpools. The shape of a human skin pore, which is nature's ultimate air conditioning system. We think that we overcome friction by going in a straight line. Humanity's approach is really not working. Nature's approach has been working for billions of years. So copying nature in these things, or trying to reverse engineer what nature's doing, is called biomimicry. This piece here is the world's first frozen whirlpool. I spent about 20 years trying to work out how to get this shape. And now we've, we've got the blueprint for all movement, for all energy propagation in our known universe. This allows us to reinvent the industrial world. The way to be curious and go forth in a sustainable, less messy way is to keep nature as mentor. If you're interested in exploration, any human being can take humanity forward to a brighter future than we've ever experienced in history.